Hello everyone and welcome to the 6th episode of our Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke. And in the previous episode, we got our 5th badge. And now, we can use Cut outside of battle, which is really good for us. So, now in today's episode, we are going to go explore this Team Galactic base. If we are even allowed to right now. I think that was the looker right there. Oh yeah, that was the looker. Hello! It is me! Me! Ha ha ha! I startled you, yes! I am, after all, an officer of the International Police. It is only natural that I'd be a master of disguise. Incidentally, you are a first-rate trainer. Of that, I am very aware. I therefore think you will be okay, but I must warn you to be careful anyways. Also, a word of advice. This building has two stairs. One of them, a trap it must be. Crooks of Team Galactic, they do not appear. I'll shut. Oh, I say. Smart. Yeah, you uh, just changed in front of them and they're not doing anything about it. There should be an easy way to tell the stairs apart. Uh, well, yeah. Obviously. That one's guarded. Let's see what's up here, though. There might be items. Item over there, which we can't go get. Though it looks like the other, uh, set of stairs was the wrong one, even though it was guarded. Looks like we get a double battle, though, which is always fun. We are acquiring Pokemon for a most astonishing something. I accidentally clicked A. And didn't read it! Oh, look, there's a Combi! And then we gotta show who the real Combi is. After, of course, Dante kills it. And let's bug bite the marrow. That should do some damage. Certainly did enough damage to the combi. Though it looks like uh, combi's bug bite isn't doing much. And it looks like even more that... Dante's gonna have to do more work. Alright. There we go. That should take care of Slack off and Meryl. Bye bye, Meryl, probably? Maybe? Let's see. Yep. Bye bye, Meryl. Meryl is gone. Woo. And give us terrible experience. Alright. Let's go with the Fury Swipes on this one, because why not? And I accidentally pressed the bag. Let's see. And. Not too good to bug bite because I think it's part psychic. Probably, maybe, most likely. Because I know its evolution is psychic flying. I just don't remember if not to is psychic flying. Because I know the typing has changed sometimes. And it must be because uh, it was normally effective, and that did more damage than I was hoping. Let's heal him real quick. That last super potion that we have. There we go. Level 21 for Queen. Oh! Queen gets to evolve! That's good for us and terrible for our enemies. So now we have a Vespa Queen. Now we got that Vespa power. Ooh, it's trying to learn Power Gem. Alright, special. Let's get rid of Sweet Scent. Because we don't use that anyways. Let's check out our queen, though. Let's see. Serious still. Pressure. Wait. Attack and special attack are the same, so that doesn't matter. So, great defenses. So now we got a semi-bulky Pokemon. Besides beautiful and temp. And everyone is level 17 or above, so we'll keep Dante in the front. Alright. Well, that guy didn't even try and battle us. Huh. Oh, look, a spell tag. Something we're not going to use. Like most of the items you pick up in a randomizer. Yay! 
right, so let's see. I'm gonna assume this is the right stairs. Looks like it was, but there's an item in the other one, so we're gonna go get that. Despite having to battle for it. Because items are worth it. Or apparently not battle over it. Rare bone. Oh, that's money, I guess. That's always nice. Money is always nice. Now we get to go up here. And... I will assume this is the right one, and... Hello, scientist! Our mission is, Im implement is to implement our operation without question. It is all for the new world or order that our boss will lead. Huh. Kinda reminds me of Trump, except they're actually planning something. And of course, we f uh, get to fight a water type instead of something Dante can take care of. But that's why we have our dancer right here. Because we got that Mega Drain. Alright. A few more Mega Drain should do. And let's finish it off with a cut. Because we're cutting this scientist out of our poles. Alright, there it goes. That Dante gets a level, that's nice. And Dancer's still level 17, so. Let's actually switch uh, Dante with my low tick. Alright, here we go. That was not the right way, but it lets items, so that is worth it. Spooky plates. Being born to bind time and space. So, Garatinas. Right, looks like we have to go battle this guy. Or not, because apparently they are blind as hell. But on the bright side, we could take this item before even initiating the story. And hello, Bicycle Man. What is it with this Team Galactic? Why did they take our Pokemon? Why are they? What are they trying to accomplish? Um, okay. Eh? Did you want something? How silly of me to even ask. You want to free the Pokemon. Fine. I, Jupiter, will deal with you. Alright, let's see if you're even a challenge. You poet. That's a Zubat, too. Cool. You will never win with a team like that! Probably. Most likely. And bye bye, Zubat. Mammo Swine! Jesus. Alright, so Mammo Swine. Ground. Ice. So. That's bad for Dante, Terra, Dancer, Tem, and Queen, technically, by typing. So we're just going to stay in with Beautiful and see how much we can do with the water gun. I mean, water, Paul, wait, we're choice specs. Alright, choice specs should be enough, though. Should, maybe, hopefully. Come on, let's luster purge this Mammoth Swine from the battlefield. And not too much damage. Oh, instantly. Take a bite of this, child. Alright. Water Pulse would have did so much damage. But we're stuck in the Lost Purge, and I don't really feel safe switching in and out of anything else. So, yeah. Don't be a crit. Good boy. Or girl, whatever that man was like, is not critting us. Girl. Alright, I think we are out of a uh, cluster of purchase now. No, we got one more, but we should probably heal first. Oh, and we have energy roots that we can use to fully heal us. It's a lot better than just spamming potions. And still using Mud Bomb. Let's use a luster purge and almost 
finish off the mammoth swine because ooh crit ugh that accuracy drop too ugh. and we missed okay mammoth swine just fucked us up so let's head off to dancer so far I hasn't shown any ice moves yet so we're semi safe unless we get like a million accuracy uh, decreases for now let's just Stun it. Oh shit, it has powder snow. Okay then. It's most likely going to use powder snow next, so. Let's actually switch to temp. Then we can spam bite. See if we can get that para flinch strat off. At least it's not using the mud bomb. That still did more damage than I wanted it to. Okay, we got it to flinch, so it's probably gonna heal, so. Knock off. Oh, wow! Wow! Just, just wow. Oh shit, like that, if that thing had ice shard, that would have been so bad for us. Oh, <laughs> that would have been terrible. On the bright side, Dancer got a level up. Tim almost did. Tim. Jim! Well, aren't you tough? It's okay, though. Our official Pokemon statue investigation is finished. Mars has collected enough energy from the Valley Windworks. We're pretty much finished here. I'll let you in on one little thing. Our boss is researching the myths of ancient Pokemon. With the power of mythical pun Pokemon, he will become the ruler of Sinnoh. I suggest you keep out of Team Galactic Galactic's affairs from now on. This is your last warning. Oh yeah, totally. I got my Clefairy back and soul thanks to you. That, but that Team Galactic. He said Clefairy came from space. Hand it over! Their logic baffles me still. It's like they're from space. Anyway, they're gone now. Thank you very much. I can't thank you enough right now, but be sure to cruise by my cycle shop. Yeah, buns. Kind of, maybe. Bad words. Let's get out of here as fast as we can, though. Alright, there we go. Is there anything in the trash? The trash can is empty. Whoop de doo. Cut that down. And let's go heal, cause uh three of our Pokemon are on pretty low health. Which is kinda bad for us. Alright, so let's go stop by the site. Or Nah, because Cynthia's going to interrupt us. Oh, there you are. I was looking for you. I've got something nice. I want you to have this Pokemon egg. Of course I'll take it, but I don't have enough room. Alright. Let's go deposit a Pokemon then, because... Eggs. Who doesn't like eggs? Alright, so let's temporarily put down, well, not put down, but put away Dancer, because, come on, what does she really do? Alright, so, Pokemon Egg it is. Alright, Pokemon Egg. Pokemon inside the Pokemon is happy, too. I'm sure of it. Keep that egg with you in your party of Pokemon. Pokemon will hatch from it while you're traveling. I will be happy to know that I will fill another page of your Pokedex. See you again! Alright, bye Cynthia, thanks for the egg. The only time in a Pokemon game when a woman will give you her egg. Thanks for res- Thanks for rescuing me. This is something to show my thanks. It's the latest model bicycle. You must take it. I insist. The latest model, so I'll read the operation manual to you. I don't need that. But thank you, anyways. We're gonna go 
register that in our bag real quick. And now we can bike. Don't tell me you don't have an explorer kit. You should have a word with the man next door to the Pokemon Center. Oh yay, let's go skip that. Because apparently we need to do that. Let's just skip that because we need that for this to progress. And I do not want to go deal with that. Alright. Here we go. And off we are to the cycling road in Route 2206. Oops, I did not mean to do that. I forgot that we go downwards. Yo, cycling and Pokemon, which do you prefer? I prefer Pokemon, obviously. But you obviously prefer bicycling, because you have shit! And we still don't do that much damage. Oh shit, if we got hit with that magic coat, that would have been bad. Wait, magic coat or mirror coat? Magic coat, okay, we're fine. I thought it was mirror coat for a second. <laughs> if it was mirror coat, that would have been terrible for us. We would have lost beautiful. And that would not have been beautiful to watch. We're here. And it's our starter. Our beautiful, beautiful starter who's now level 18. Alright. Goodbye, Jonathan. Alright. The bug man over there. Alright, here we go. Whoops! That was a trap for sure. If you could beat me, you could count on something Ron coming on your way. Oh, sure. Ghastly. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Curse me? Or confuse me? Okay! Oh! Oh. Well, shit. Shit, actually. Shit, we might actually lose beautiful nightshade plus that, so. Oh, no. No! It's going to use nightshade on us, and if we heal, it's going to use nightshade. We do not outspeed. We will either die from the nightshade or we will die from the curse. Oh, we're dying for the night. Ah, oh, god damn it! That's our starter! Damn it! That was foolish as hell of me. Alright, so let's go into Tem then. Let's knock the shit right off of that ghastly. Bastard ruined my Pokemon. Though, let's go deposit him. Sadly, well, her actually. I think it was a her. I don't remember. I have a terrible memory. Okay. Our starter already has made it to the dead box. But before we do anything else, let's go hatch this egg. Just to see what shit we get. Alright. Oops, shit, I didn't mean to do that. Okay.
Oh, that also reminds me. Didn't we find a fossil in a previous episode? There we go, the dome fossil. Let's actually see if we could, uh, restore it. Hello, who are you? I see fossil Pokemon. Oh, yes. Okay, let's go get ourselves our fossil Pokemon then. Soul Rock. Ooh, we got a Soul Rock. So you're Soul Rock, you like the sun. So let's name you Soul Air. I'm trying to remember how that was spelled. Solar. No, that's solar. 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 Okay, that's close enough. Now let's take a look at him though. I believe he'll be level 20. I know I spelled that terribly wrong. Bold nature, that's not bad. Okay, levitate, obviously. Confusion. Okay, and it's better attack, so. Rock throw, rock, rock pol, rock polish. That's gonna be very helpful. Well, let's see if we can teach him any TMs. Like rock blast, especially. Oh my god. That would be, uh, never mind. That sucks. Alright, what about tri triple kick? No, he cannot. Well, that sucks. I guess we go back to, uh, trying to hatch this egg. Alright, there we go. This egg will hatch eventually! It must. Whoops. Did not need to play that far. Oops, that was the B-Bun. Okay, how far are we even from hatching this egg? Like, seriously, egg. What are you that takes so long? Doesn't seem close to hatching, so... I guess I'll be right back and we're gonna go hatch this egg real quick. I'll be back as soon as it hatches. All right. See you in a bit. Alright guys, we're finally getting to, it to hatch, so without further ado, let us see what we get. Hopefully it's something amazing, but it's probably gonna be like a Jigglypuff or something. Or a Numel, that's not that bad. It's not bad, but eh. She's not a disappointment, that's for sure. Alright, so let's just name her Vol and Vulcan. Good enough. Okay. I guess it's to the box with us. Well, to the box for her. Oops, accidentally clicked the wrong buttons again. Right, there we go. Let's take our dancer back and replace him. Replace Vulcan, who's just sitting there, level one. Probably always going to be level one forever week. Who knows, maybe we'll use it one day. But today is not that day. All right, so let's get back up there. Now we're on well, 2207. Okay, so now we just. We can go actually get a Route 206 encounter, maybe? I don't know. Hold on, let me check the map. Right, so we're on Route 206. 205, 211. Yep, we are fine. And survey says that we will find a... <gasps> we found an Umbreon! That's pretty nice. Mine's catch range, probably shit. 
Alright, so let's go for a power gem. We really even got that pursuit. Got that blaze waiting for us to switch. Alright, that does half decent damage. Let's try a gust. Let's go for one more power gem. Okay, so it has helping hand pursuit. And we'll probably see after I throw this next ball, because it probably won't get got. Yep, I was right. But does it show off another? Nope. Only showing off that helping hand. And so let's go for a Pokeball. Ah, oh, damn it, so close. Oh, stand attack. Pursuit, helping hand. Eh, it's not bad. It could use improvement, though. And we almost got it again. How about this time? Woo! Got it! Go us! Go Umbreon. Alright. It's a Dark type. It's an Umbreon. Of course, I'm going to name it Moonlight, since I am terrible at naming Pokemon. Alright, there we go. Midnight has been named. But for now, let us progress a little bit further. Get some items and such. There's some berries right there. And a lag another lagging tail that we do not need. Counter. Okay, another Umbreon. Can't escape. Okay, there we go. There we go. And now, if we get in, we can get a Wayward Cave encounter. See what we find. And it is a. Goldfish. Survey says. Get away, because I don't want this. Ah! Um. Um. Oh. Oh no. Solaire is good with defense, and it doesn't resist rock, even though it's a rock type. Okay, though, let's see if we can run. No. Okay, we're gonna have to heal. Okay. We are not going to be able to live another rollout. We can't run. And whatever we switch is into dies. So, I'll end the episode here, and let's have a little quote of the day. Who should be the one who gets sacrificed? Should Solaire die, Terra, Tem, Dante, Dancer, or Queen be the one to take that final roll, roll out? I hope you all enjoyed this episode, and please like, comment, especially comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all next time. See ya!